Hello, welcome to another Pages for Mac tutorial. This one is going to be on inserting images to your document. When you've opened your document and working on it, you will see along the top toolbar that there is a button called Media. If we click on that button, then we get a few options. We do have the option to import photos, and if you click on this one, it is actually linked to your Photos app within your computer, so any of the photos that you have in there will show up in here that you're able to choose from. Or, if you go down to where it says Choose and click on this, that will allow you to find any image that you might want to use. So I'm going to go ahead and use this one from a different one that I was doing, and I'm going to go ahead and insert it. When I insert it, it's going to insert right where I had my cursor. So if you wanted it in a different spot, move your cursor, and that'll allow you to. Or you could take the picture and drag and drop it. If you see as I'm moving it, it is moving it within the text. To change this, where and how it embeds, you would go to the right toolbar here and you would click on Arrange. And then you will see the text wrap right here where it says automatic and you can change it much like you can within Word. Also, if you click on the style, you can choose what style you want to have for this picture. There are many different options, so you want to make sure to choose the one that suits what you are doing the best. You can change the different border types, different colors of the borders. Uh, if you want your picture to have a reflection or not, uh, title, caption, there are a lot of different things that you can do with this. Another thing that you can do that is actually really, really cool with this is let's say I want to go down here. I'm going to insert another picture right after this paragraph. So I'm going to go ahead and click there. I'm going to enter and I'm going to go to media. And if you're on the same iCloud account as your computer, as you are on maybe your iPhone or your iPad, you can actually use these here to take a picture with those. So I'm gonna to go to my iPad and I'm gonna actually tell it to take a photo. And I know you can't see it, but right now on my iPad, I have my photo browser up and the camera up, sorry, excuse me. And if I take the picture, I can insert it and use photo and it'll come straight over to the Mac just like that. So it's kind of fun if you have a document you wanted to scan or a picture you're taking uh, that you want to throw in there, you can just throw it right in. Now the last thing that I wanted to show on this one is also again in that media tab. I'm just going to go to the bottom here. Up in the media tab, you can see that you can insert an image gallery. When you do this, this box will appear where you can drag your images to have. So you can have multiple images that the kids are able to swipe through on their final document. Or if you have instructions that you want to use, you can place them in there. But that is it for inserting images for Pages for Mac. As always, if you need any help, you know how to find me. Please come down to the swamp and one of us will be able to help you out. Thanks.